But shaitan comes to us in the same way he came to Ibrahim alayhi salatu wasalam to try and distract him from fulfilling the command of Allah. The command of Allah to him was different from what it is to us. For us, it's pretty simple. Allah asks you to worship him alone. Subhanallah. The most important day today is known as a day of Tawheed. A day of the oneness of Allah. A day when we worship Allah alone. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. La ilaha illa Allahu, Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar, walillahi alhamd. Allah is the greatest. Allah is the greatest. Allah is the greatest. There is none worthy of worship besides Allah. To Him belongs all praise. Indeed, Allah is the greatest. To Him belongs all praise. Subhanallah, it's the day of Tawheed, which means the oneness of Allah. Shaitan will come to you in this matter to try and make you worship things and deities besides Allah that don't exist. Subhanallah. Things besides Allah, shaitan will make you try and worship your own desires and fancies, your own mind at times where there is something absurd. But because it's in your mind, you think you want to do it. If you're a believer, you surrender to the instruction of Allah. That's what will bring you success and true contentment. And when you return to Allah, your maker who made you from nothing, subhanallah. People say, well, you know, Allah created man from dust and soil. Agreed. It's true. So why do you say Allah created you from nothing? Because Allah created the dust and soil from nothing. Subhanallah. Amazing. It's Allah. Innama amruhu idha arada shay'an ayyakula lahu kun fayakun. His instruction when he wants to create something is only that he says be. And it is. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us the development of the understanding of his greatness. It's the day, like I said, of worshipping Allah alone. For fulfilling the instruction of Allah to you and I, it makes sense. You pray, you have to pray to Allah. Someone might say, why do I have to make wudu? and wash my face and my hands when I have let out wind and I'm not washing my behind. It's a good question. Actually, it's the instruction of Allah. That's the answer. It made sense to you. It didn't make sense to you. No problem. It's not even a major matter and you're questioning. Look at Ibrahim alayhi salatu wasalam. A major matter. He didn't even question.